Bounces out. First rebound of the game for Sylvia Fowles. Danielle Robinson slices through the defense. Off the glass, D-Rob. Uh, on the national team for Eurobasket for that tournament that goes just past the 4th of July. It's something that has always been difficult in the WNBA. One for two for Nurse, to correct myself there. Christmas Kelly lines up the three ball. Gets it to go, Karima Christmas Kelly. He's setting up the offense, giving it to Odyssey Sims to work against the defense. Nice pass to Sylvia Fowles, who finishes. Tina Charles is just such a pro. She just sees the double team and just so calmly takes her time to get in the pass out. Nice answer from Fowles off the glass. He has it, looking for an option, finds it from Charles with four on the shot clock. Tina Charles gives it up to Boyd. Fowles is there. I don't know if it'll be a shot clock violation or a block, but either way, it was a nice defensive possession by the link. It's just way more fun. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Our first look at Lexi Brown tonight gives it to Christmas Kelly. Karima for three. And I love when you think because she hasn't been playing her best basketball that she's still not going to be one of the greatest players in the league. Nice pass from Dantes to Silk. 1,000 career assist threshold. Karima Christmas Kelly gets a shot up. Deflected and running the other way. Here comes New York. And that pass is picked off by D. Rob. She's got a lanky defender to beat. It up in this game because this is making her so much more difficult to guard, just attacking the basket. I like. Right, guarded by Brown. Yeah! Stolen away by Christmas Kelly. Karima takes a little contact, crosses over, puts it up off the glass in. Oh, okay. The shot clock, Charles loses it again. What a messy possession for New York. And it ends it in a Liberty miss. Odyssey Sims breaks free to the hoop, and she scores, and she's fouled. Boyd drives to the baseline. Here's Wright. Denisha Wright can't get the long bounce, and another offensive rebound. That one was stripped, though, on the shot. D. Rob to Sims. Odyssey Sims. You mentioned particularly that last game with 22 points, six assists. She's got the attention of opposing teams. Odyssey Sims gets the role. It's a rookie, Kia Nurse, just a second year player. So there's a lot of talent and room to grow. Speaking of room to grow, Sylvia Fowles has done that throughout her career. Eight points as the Lynx establish her right away in the second half. And that could be the difference in the second half is can Sylvia Fowles make an impact in this half? She only had six because of foul trouble in the first half. Can she play the whole second half and be effective? Rejects the screen from Dantes. They're swinging around Collier. And now fouls. And she's fouled. Back to back baskets for Sill in the Lynx. Boxing out assignment. Odyssey Sims stops, loses the defender, and kisses the glass. First by fouls, second by Dantes. Now the lob. Sill. That time finished. I know that feels good for Sylvia Fowl. Swings it all the way around to Collier. She hits the three. Collier drives, kicks it out. That's Robinson. She got it from the baseline. Short on the shot, but finds her own miss. Uh-oh. And then finds her way out of a jam there. Collier, the three-point try. She's ready. She's feeling confident right now. Odyssey Sims, who leads Minnesota with 20 points. Christmas Kelly on the drive to the roll. What a game for Karima Christmas Kelly. Now into double figures with 11 points. She knows that her team needs her to hit that shot in this game. Durr hits a basket for New York. And then Dantes. How in the world did she get that shot to fall? Fouls as a defender. Now here's Charles with Dantes on her. Right behind the line. Drive swatted away. What a block by Sylvia Fowles.